Shalom. First off, we want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakadash. We want to give double honors to the elders and apostles, the great maelstrom, they rule well. Peace and salutations to all your brothers that are expressing the truth and sincerity. I was in charity, man. I'm the brother here, Yawakana. I'm with the brother Malaakia here from the Great Millstone Camp here in Des Moines. And uh, we come at you with another, um, another lesson inspired by the Raka Kadash, the Holy Spirit that works within the uh, hopeful elect, rightly dividing the word of truth. So uh, basically what the, the Spirit hit us, man, you know, and on what you see on screen is it says um, only God can judge us, man. That's that's what, you know, that's what these people say out here in the world, that only God can judge them, you know, and that's a mentality of Tupac, actually. You know, that's that's actually not written in the scriptures at all. You know, and, and, and us knowing this truth, this marvelous light, you know, that we know we can judge righteously, man. And and Lord's will, this lesson is edifying, man. We're going to get a couple of scriptures out and, uh, um, you know, hopefully uh, this is edifying, man. You know, uh, I want to get that Luke. It says Luke 6 and 37. It says, judge not and ye shall not be judged. Condemn not. And ye shall not be condemned. Right. So, hey, just, just with that right there, you know, people think, see, hey, it, it's it's telling you not to judge, you know. But hey, well, uh, 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 well, you really you gotta read the, the totality, you know. You gotta read the totality of the of that uh, uh of that chapter, man, to understand what what it's really saying, right? It says, uh, and ye shall not be condemned. Forgive, and ye shall be forgiven. It says thirty seven. Give, and it shall be given unto you. Good measure, pressed down and shaken together, and running over shall men uh, give unto your bosom. For with the same measure that ye meet uh, with shall, it shall be measured to you again. And he spake a parable unto them. Can the blind lean the blind? Shall they, they both not fall into the ditch? Right. It says the disciple is not above his master. But every one that is perfect shall be as his master. And why beholdest thou the mote that is in thy brother's eye? This is the point, right? This is the point of, of uh, uh, verse 37. It says, judge not, and ye shall uh, not be judged. Condemn not, and ye shall not be condemned, right? So if we're going to condemn somebody, what? All right, this is given the, the, the explanation, right? If, if we behold the mote that is in our brother's eye, right? You're seeing something. Hey, hey, hey brother, this is wrong with you. Right, go ahead. But perceivest not the beam that is in thy own eye. But you ain't focusing in and in, 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 uh, examining thyself uh, uh, to, to to see what the fuck is wrong with you, right? Go ahead. It says, e uh, either how canest thou say to thy brother, brother, let me pull out thy mote and that is in thy eye, uh, when thou thyself uh, beholdest not the beam that is in thy own eye. Right. So how I'ma tell this brother, hey, hey, bro, hey, hey, what, this, this, and that. When I myself am, am, am not checking myself, analyzing myself, and seeing how fucked up I am, man, huh? seeing the things that I'm doing incorrectly, you know. Uh, uh, real quick, um, this is damn. How was that written then? Uh, Examine rather read in the faith. What? Examine thyself. Con. 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 This is a uh, Second Corinthians. <laughs> So, sorry, it's a lucky. Second Corinthians chapter thirteen and verse five. Examine yourselves whether ye be in the faith. Prove your own selves, right? Prove your own selves. Hey, hey man, put put yourself through these things. You know, just like you gotta prove gold. Hey, hey man, prove yourself. Prove the works that you're doing. Pr prove your actions. Prove whether you're in the faith, man. You call yourself a man of the Most High. Hey, hey, and and you know, these lessons. You know, we're speaking to ourselves first and foremost, man. You know. So examining ourselves every single day, man. Am, am I walking in the spirit? In the spirit being according to the to, 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 to the scriptures, man? Am I conducting myself as, as a servant of Yahweh Basham, Yahweh Shai? Am I being a true ambassador of our Lord, Yahweh Shai HaMashayach, man? You know? When people look at me, hey, hey, hey. That, well, well, what are they seeing, man? You know? Am I doing the, the 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 right things? Am I taking the right steps? Am I am I purging myself from certain things? Am I am I fasting? Am I studying? Am I reading? Am I making? Am I doing my lessons? Am I being a good brother? You know. It says, "No, uh, prove your own selves. Know ye not your own selves? How that Yahweh Shai Hamashiach is in you, except ye be reprobates." Okay, so hey, hey we got to examine ourselves daily, man. That's something. 
that that, that that we do every single day, man. Through the Spirit, we got to do that. And and the things that we're lacking, hey, we pray on it, and, and we correct those things through the Spirit, according to wisdom, according to knowledge. You know, it says back at Luke six and third and forty two. Neither how canst thou say to thy brother, brother, let me pull out the mote that is in thy own in thy eye, when thou thyself beholdest not the beam in, that is in thy own eye, thou hypocrite. Cast out first the beam out of thy own eye, and then uh, shalt thou see clearly to put out the mote that is in thy brother's eye. Right there, you go, man. Hey, and and this is a this is a, a perfect precept, you know. Precept going back to what a law, a, a, a command. So hey, hey, in this truth, man, that that, that that's that's a a, a a a very important thing, man. You know how how much more are we? To, to to examine ourselves before hey, hey, uh, 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 giving out judgment, man. Here you have it. We go out uh, 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 every single weekend, and we're gonna we're gonna judge our people. You know, you might see a whole Jake walking with a with a pork sandwich. You know, hey, well, whatever the case may be, man. Hey, but are you doing the right things? You know, but but before you go out, before you speak, before you testify of the Lord, man. Hey, are you right? Are you yourself right? Before you tell a brother, hey, brother, you need to, you need to do this, this, that. Hey, man, are are, are you all right? You know, how, how much more us, man? Yeah, cause I mean, hypocrisy, really. That <laughs> I mean, pride is hateful before men and uh, and the Most High. Hey, the Lord hates that shit, man. <laughs> but even even everyday life. Hey, salak. Go, no, go no, ahead. No, go no, ahead. But you know, you <laughs> you you see a dude. For example, <laughs> I'm gonna use this dude again at the at the job, man. Motherfucker, man, he be telling me stop taking so much breaks, right? And I be sitting down real quick. And this dude, every time I go, I can't find this dude because he's upstairs doing some bullshit, probably hiding. But this is the this guy's the biggest hypocrite, man. I, you know what I'm saying? Like you you can't get along with that, man. This dude's trying to me to do tell me to do something, but he he's doing the complete opposite, man. You can't get along with somebody like that, man. You know? You know, hey, I was just gonna say, man, hey, the uh, hey, Yahweh Shah was hey, was cussing out uh, 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 the scribes and Pharisees, man, for being hypocrites. <laughs> you know, he he he, he said, uh, uh, basically, a hey, hey, do as they say, but not as they do, because they say but they do not. <laughs> hey, man, that's not the fucking spirit that we're to be in, man. Going off on Jake, are oh, you you? You're lining up your beard and you're eating pork and uh, you're, but uh, here I here here it is. I'm being a whole ass nigga. Yeah, you should you should get in your Bible and you should study and we the Jews and and, and we the Israelites. But yeah, here here I am, not doing not 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 studying, not reading. You know, hey man, we gotta examine ourselves before we go uh, before we go uh, declare judgment, man. We gotta judge righteously. How are we gonna know how to discern what is right, what is wrong, if we're not in our if we're not in our in our scriptures, man? If we're not uh, in the spirit, hey, King Solomon said that. You know, he asked for more wisdom to be able to, to judge righteously, man. Let me see if I can grab that real quick. Uh, can I get a precept real quick? Time. It says uh, John seven and twenty four: Judge not according to the appearance, but judge righteous judgment, man. You know. So that's what I'm saying. I mean, just because you see, uh, let's say, uh, a, a bum on the streets or or maybe you see somebody that uh, uh, might not have a lot of money, you know, first of all, us Israelites, we're in the lowest state anyways, man. You know, now the people of this world look at lineups. Oh, this dude don't have a lineup. You know what I'm saying? So he ugly or whatnot. Whatever. But guess what? Who we serve, man? Yahweh Ba Hashim Shai. The one who made the, uh, the heavens and the earth, man. You know, that's who we serve, man. We don't care if we don't get our lineups. We don't care if if our hair is on fleek, how they say it these days, man. You know, we don't care about none of that, man, because our rest is not here first and foremost, man. But it says it says back. I'm going to read it again. It says John 7 and 24. Judge not according to the appearance, but judge righteous judgment. So, yes, we can judge. Yes, we can judge according to the standard, man. Yep. You know, hey, hey, and that's it, man. You, you, you hey, even with these other camps, you can see that they're not fucking spiritual, man. You can see that they're not in the spirit. You can see that the Lord ain't dealing with them, man. Because here you have it. Hey, hey, a, 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 a whole person that looked like an Edomite will walk by the camp. Fuck you, Esau. You're going into captivity and blah, blah, blah. Well, when it's a is it correct? It's a is it correct? That look, you know, it's a, it's a northern kingdom that looked like Esau. 
But he a Jake. Yeah. <laughs> I know I cut myself on that sometimes. Cause you know? I be saying fucking Esau, even though this dude can be a whole Jake. I haven't tried the spirit yet. But you know that I cut myself on that. You know, right? And, 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 and hey, you might think that. You know, you might think, hey, look, look at this Edomite. And then hey, you'll, you'll go talk to him or something. You'll, you'll have an interaction with them. You'll be like, damn, he a Jake. You know? Yeah. But hey, it's not like you've seen him and then oh, oh, curses on this motherfucker and hey, fuck you and the, nah, man, that's 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 not right. It says it says try the spirit by the spirit whether they be of the Most High. That's what we gotta do. That is righteous judgment, man. Well, according to the scriptures, but how would you know that if you're not in your scriptures, man? But it says too. It says, how can we judge the smallest matters if we're just gonna throw curses on somebody? Hey, that's 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 a that's a precept we're gonna get, Lord willing. You know what I'm saying? You know? Go ahead. This is Second Chronicles chapter one and verse. Uh, ooh. Verse 8 I'll start at verse 8 It says And Solomon said unto the Most High Thou hast showed me great thou, Salakia, thou hast showed great mercy unto David my father And has made me to reign in his stead Now O Yahweh my power Let thy promise unto David my father be established For thou hast made me king Over a people like the dust of the earth in multitude Right? Give me now wisdom and knowledge. This is King Solomon praying, give asking for wisdom and knowledge. For what? That I may go out and come in before this people. For who can judge this thy people that is so great? And the Most High said to Solomon, Because this was in thine heart, and thou hast not asked riches, wealth, or honor, nor the life of thine enemies, neither yet has asked how long life, Salakia, has asked long life, but has asked wisdom and knowledge for thyself that thou mayest judge my people Ooh. over whom I had made thee king. Wisdom and knowledge is granted unto thee, and I will give thee riches and wealth and honor such as none of the kings have had that have been before thee, neither shall there be any like after thee. And hey, th 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 that's the thing, man. We got to be asking for more wisdom. Hey, the, in wisdom of Solomon, it tells you that what? Hey, hey that I, I knew not that wisdom was the mother of, of all these things. Hey, man, with wisdom comes riches. Uh, uh, it, it says, uh, uh, roughly paraphrasing, ye that desire scepters and thrones, desire wisdom that ye may reign, forever. reign forevermore, man. You know? So with, with, with this wisdom, with the understanding, uh, 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 asking for these spiritual gifts, asking for spiritual discernment through the wisdom and the knowledge according to the scriptures, that is going to bring us into the kingdom, man. Hey, that, that, that's what's going to get us there But what, hey, the point being Is that yes, we can judge Hell yeah, we can judge <laughs> And what it is saying there too I love that precept, why? Because in there it says my people Israel, right? And who's 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 the uh, uh, number one people That says only God can judge me? Yeah, it's all people There you have it, <laughs> a, 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 a whole nigga woman You know, <laughs> the loudest The loudest, most clamorous ones, man oh, Only God can judge me who are you to say this? And who are you, <laughs> motherfucker? No, hey man, we, we hey, just like just like we we have a, 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 a damn. It says I'm full of the spirit, you know, to uh, to preach glad tidings unto the meek. Hey man, along with that, hey hey, it says go out, go out. Can you get that Bible Kusha? Show my people their transgressions. And that was a Jacob their sins. Oh yeah, Isaiah 58. Bible Kusha. I got that real quick. Let's cry loud, spread not. Yeah. Yep. 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 Isaiah, this is Isaiah 58 and 1. It says, cry out, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet and show my people their transgressions. Right, show my people their transgressions. So when you're seeing somebody going off, well, oh, you know what, well, we're out there. Hey, man, you, hey, hey, you, you, hey, you know you're an Israelite? Hey, well, hey, well, according to the scriptures, you, hey, you ain't supposed to be doing that. All right, am, I, am I doing that? <laughs> you know, that's, the, that's what you got to do, uh, do first. Examine yourself first. Right, but 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 once you know, hey, okay, you tell them, you you give them, hey, just like you gotta go to a courtroom, hey, boop, there I'm I'm presenting you with your case. All right, go ahead. It says, and show my people their transgressions and the house of Jacob their sins. There it is, man. And it says that that, that whether they hear or they forbear, hey, hey, but once we tell them, hey, the blood's off our hands. And and, and once uh, uh uh oh once hey, if they hearken not. Unto the words of Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shai, then hey, then, then you tell him, hey, all right, well, hey, there's a judgment for your ass, man. <laughs> We're judging. Hey, what the Lord say? What the Lord say? Hey, repent, or you shall likewise perish. It says, uh, uh, Luke 13, 1. 
Uh, Likewise, Parish. No, it's lucky. <clears throat> It says, "Oh fuck!" What you looking for? Kingdom of Heaven is at hand. Oh, uh, that's I believe that's John. Matthew chapter ten, and verse six. It says, "But." Go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel, and as ye go, preach, saying unto them, The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Hey, Amen. So, so you're telling them, hey, re repent, man, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. The same thing John the Baptist did, the same thing Yahweh Shai did. Hey, now it's in our office. Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai called us into this ministry, man. You know? Hey, but what? Many are called, few are chosen, man. But nevertheless, hey, we've been called into this. So, so the, it is our office to tell these people, hey, show them their transgressions, tell them the right way, whether they hear, whether they, they forbear, hey, that's 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 on them, man. But you judge, you you judge them, man. You tell them. Yeah, we're okay, sure. Okay, you 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 want to keep doing, uh 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 uh, you want to keep committing sodomy, you 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 want to keep uh, uh fucking committing adultery, you want to keep eating that goddamn pork, little boozy ass, right? All right, man. Hey, if you don't fucking repent, you're going to die a horrible death. This, this, and this is coming, man. They said the same show, Noah, uh, by death, by pain. How are you going to tell me only God can judge me? No. <laughs> no. God gave a, 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 a who, who you ignorantly call God, his real name being Yahweh, saying his only begotten son, Yahweh Shah, hey, man, even in the time of Moses. Moses was set up to, 12, uh, 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 to give judgments unto the 12 tribes, man. <laughs> you know So it wasn't any different back then It's, it's no different now man I got real, one real quick It says Luke 1 and 70 He said oh, it's a lot, yeah. It said Luke 1 and, 7, 1 and 70 As he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets Which have been since the world began Who is the he? Is Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai man so yes, the Lord is judging you through, through, through the prophets that, that are in the highways and byways, man. Yes, you are getting judged 100%. We are showing you your nakedness, man. What you're doing wrong. You know, like the brother said, we're getting our, our you know, our, our, our um, hands, you know, uh, clean. Because we ain't, we ain't gonna uh, be, uh, have that blood in our hands, man. You know, because we're, 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 we're judging, man. We're judging according to the standard that was set by Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, man. Right, because we, we can't take these things into our hands, man. Here, here you, you have a whole sodomite walk by the camp. Hey, we can't lift up stones and stone them according to the law. No, no. Hey, man, we're in our captivity. So we tell them, hey, your ass is going to hey, uh, uh, fucking burn and fire and brimstone. There's going to be torments, apparitions. The Lord is going to send you the, your greatest fears upon you. You're going to perish. Your house is going to perish. You know? Hey, hey, this is uh, Exodus chapter 18 because what? Hey, hey you had, like I, like I mentioned, the Most High, Yahweh, set up Moses, right, uh, uh, to, to give unto these people statues, uh, uh, give them the judgments that the Lord ha had ordained, right? And he was judging. He was being the official judging uh, uh, between matters. And he went into his uh, his father-in-law, Jethro, right? Uh, and this is Jethro speaking unto him. Uh, Exodus 18 and 17. And Moses' father-in-law said unto him, the thing that thou doest is not good. Why is it not good? Thou will surely wear away both thou and this people that is with thee, for this thing is too heavy for thee. Thou art not able to perform it thyself alone. Right? Hearken now unto my voice. I will give thee counsel, and the Most High shall be with thee. Be thou for the people to Godward, that thou mayest bring the causes unto the Most High. Thou shalt teach them ordinances and laws, and shalt show them the way wherein they must walk, and the work that they must do. Right? Same thing with us. Moreover, thou shalt provide out of all the people, able men, such as fear the Most High, men of truth, hating covetousness, and pl and place such over them to be rulers of thousands and rulers of hundreds and rulers of fifties and rulers of tens. Right. So there's going to be people within within Israel that are going to be heads to do what? And let them judge the people <laughs> at all seasons. And it shall be that every great matter they shall bring unto thee, but every small matter they shall judge. 
so shall it be easier for thyself, and they shall bear the burden with thee. You know? And uh, uh, if you can get that precept that says, uh, 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 talking about the angels, I believe it's um, Corinthians, 1 Corinthians. Right? <laughs> and it says all seasons. It doesn't say, let the bitches go in the summer. So lock you. Uh, okay. It says, you know, not not to let these, these you know, a shameful woman in the summer and don't judge them in the summer. Let me be in the summer. Have a hot girl summer. It said all seasons. That's what it said. It didn't say just a, a exclude the summer. Nah, man. <laughs> all seasons, bud. Right, man. You can't let you can't let things pervert you from judgment. That's what that's what it says. Uh, uh, uh I believe that's what. Um, I don't remember exactly where it's at, but hey, hey, well, when you're in your drink, that perverts your judgment, man. You can't, you can't, hey, it, it might start fucking with your mind to where hey, hey, you're not going to judge uh, uh, right judgment, you know? That's why, uh, that, that, that's why, hey, uh, uh, the scripture even says rebuke not a man uh, 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 in his drink, you know? Roughly paraphrasing. But, uh, oh, you, it says you 1 Corinthians 6 and, at one. Uh, 1 Corinthians 6 and 1. Dare any of you have any mutter against another? Matter. A matter against another. Go, uh, go to law before the unjust. And not before the saints. Right. So uh, basically, what what he's saying right here is, hey man, it, it, there, there's matters against uh, 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 against within our own selves, right? Against Israel, mainly speaking to the Church of Corinth. It says, uh, "Dare any of you, having a matter against another, go to the law before the unjust and not before the saints?" Right. So you're gonna go to Esau first. You're gonna you're gonna seek to Esau to to, to give judgment, hey, and and that's what these people are doing too. You know. <laughs> They're letting Esau tell them, "Oh yeah, this is right, this is wrong." Except, except homosexuality. Uh, 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 oh, oh uh, uh, he should do this, this. Hey, okay. Before going, uh, uh, before the saints, according to Psalms, hey, the, the 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 saints are the children of Israel, man. Keep going. You know, do ye not know that the saints shall judge the world? Ooh. And if the world shall be judged by you, the saints shall what? <laughs> should judge the world only god can judge me judge the world oh but 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 but, but god's gonna judge me you can't tell me nothing but the saints shall judge the world oh okay and if the world shall be judged by you are ye unworthy to judge the smallest matters Ooh. uh know ye not that we shall judge angels boom we're gonna judge angels Woo! hey lord, lord willing we imported that number hey that's that's why we gotta be seeking this wisdom that's why King Solomon prayed for more wisdom. Hey, to, to judge the people here, if you can grab that precept, right. hey, we're going to judge the other nations. We're going to judge angels. You know? Let, let me let's just get these Come. last verses. It says, like three again, it says, ye, uh, 1 Corinthians 6 and 3, know ye not that we shall judge angels. How much more things that pertain to this life? If then ye shall have judgments of things pertaining to this life, set them to judge who are least esteemed in the uh, church. Yep. You know, so I just want, <laughs> man, that's crazy, bro. You know, that just hyped me up in the spirit, man. That's it. You know, th this is the true comforter, man. That's you know? it. Be because that, that, that's what we're being set up to do, man. That's what we're being set up to do, to judge the world. To be kings, to be rulers all, all over this world. And how can you be a, a, a righteous king, a just king, man, if you can't make these judgments? You know? So that, that quote, only God can judge me, man, that's some fucking bullshit. Okay? <laughs> hey, if you know you ain't supposed to be getting tattoos and you're getting damn tattoos, your ass is going off. And, and, and there's judgment for that. And we're going to tell you not, oh, oh, well, God. I, uh, no, nigga, hey, because God said, you know? Which one did you want, you said? So like you said, you uh, the, the the one that we were talking about, the nations. Are we gonna oh, judge the the, the judge the nations? Kind, kind, kind. I got that for you. Uh, it says wisdom of Solomon, uh, three. So I'll get this phone being bugged out. Uh, I'll grab one real quick. The Deuteronomy sixteen and eighteen: Judges and officers shalt thou make thee in all thy gates, which <laughs> the Lord thy power giveth thee, throughout thy tribes, and they shall judge the people with judgment. There you go. Thou shalt not rest judgment. Thou shalt not respect persons. Shall not respect persons. Oh well, I can serve. I can. Uh, 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 I'm a Catholic, and and uh, I, I I can pray to this saint if I want. And you got you got to respect me because uh, uh no, no, you going off the old granny that 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 serves cookies and shit. Oh 
my goodness, like Josh. Nah, bro, it doesn't matter if you old, you small, hey, you I'll great, you man. Right I'm listen. You know, I'm so it, it don't matter, man. It don't matter. We're gonna judge your ass according to the how or the spirit. You how about me? shy, and nothing you can do about it, man. Right, man. So hey, the, the, that's the thing with this judgment, man. You can't get emotional. You can't get all all, all, all worked up. No, nah, man. You judge righteously. Okay. It says, uh, "Thou shalt not respect persons, neither take a gift, for the gift doth blind the eyes of the wise and pervert the words of the righteous." Okay. Let me get that. So, wisdom, wisdom of Solomon, three and eight. They shall judge the nations. Real, uh, 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 let's. That's, that's fine. Yeah, you can start that. That's fine. I mean, I could get um. Just start that. That's cool. I can start at six just because we know that that furnace is, is talking about the one third. It says uh, wisdom of Solomon seven and, yeah, uh, and, and six. It says as gold in the furnace has he tried them, right? Who's the them? If you go to the, uh, um, Zechariah 13 and eight talks about the one third uh, being refined as, uh, as fine gold. And then uh, Sirach, the second chapter, you know, um, it says, um, and it received them as a burnt offering. And in the time of the vegetation, they shall shine and run to and fro like sparks among the stubble. Right? They shall judge the nations and have dominion over the people. And their Lord, Yahweh Shema Washai, shall reign forever. Right. So, hey, hey there you go, man. We're going <laughs> to judge the nations. Okay? All these heathens that are going out, these damn Moabites eating all these abominations, man. Their ass is going to be judged. Their ass is going to get whooped. And their ass is, is going to uphold the laws of Yahweh Basham Yahweh You know? That's the that's the point, really. I, 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 I firmly it. believe that we we hit the point in this lesson, man. Is that the, is that the Most High, hey, hey, he gave power unto his only begotten son. And his only begotten son gave us the, the, the office of, of, of being judges, man. You know? Of repairing the breaches, of, of telling our people, hey, that, that that there's there's a price that the Lord paid for us, and in return, hey, there's a price that we pay if we go off. Go ahead. And we're giving it our all, man. You know, ultimately, they, they, like the brother Yeshai just did a beautiful video. You know, there's there's a reward. You know, there's a reward at the end of this, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and I want to get this last piece up if uh, the brother don't got any more. It says uh, Matthew 19 and 28. It says in 27. Then answered Peter and said unto him, Behold, we have forsaken all and followed thee. What shall we have therefore? Right? And Yahweh Shai said unto them, Verily I say unto you, that ye have, which have followed me in the regeneration, when the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, ye shall also sit upon twelve thrones, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. There you go. You know? It says, and every one that has forsaken that houses, I mean, that's the point, right? Judging the 12 tribes of Israel, man, this is in the kingdom of heaven. How much more now, man, that, that we're calling our people back into repentance so, uh, and repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and go ahead. This brother got the uh, online entomology of uh, of the word judge. Kind of real quick. The Edomiah says uh, for judge, uh, it says to pronounce sentence, to make <laughs> a decision, to decide, think, to suppose, to pronounce judgment. Uh, to examine officially, to form uh, an opinion upon, pronounce judgment. You know, <laughs> so we're pronouncing the judgment. Hey, hey we're giving you uh, 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 um, uh, the, the 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 sentence, man. We're pronouncing your sentence, like it says. Hey, like that song says, uh, uh, that song, uh, uh, the gospel. It says, uh, uh, the wages of sin is death. So if sin is how you work, then death should be the check. You know. Hey, so death is going to be the check for a lot of these people out here that's just working iniquity. Iniquity, man. Sin upon sin. Willful sin. Hey, we're telling them, we're telling them here, hey, hey, the Lord died for you. The Lord said, don't defile your temple. Fuck it. I'm going to smoke my cigarette. All right, then your ass is going to get judged. You know? Like, fuck that's that. That's the point. Man, fuck the individual person. First of all, we're going to judge the world. Bro, we're telling Esau Edom in his goddamn face that he's going to go down, man. How much more one fucking person that's in its feeling? Right. That's the judgment, man. According to the Lord, according to what is written, that is the judgment, man. That's the judgment for this damn nation. You know? I'll tell you the judgment for America, the judgment for your sins, the uh, everything, man. The judgment for being righteous. <laughs> right? The judgment for everything, <laughs> you man. You know? Hey, but 
that's it. That's all I had. Shit. All right. So with that, we like to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahushai, Bahasham, Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone that rule well. Peace, blessings, salutations to all y'all brothers. Till the next time, we're going to say Shalom. Hey, Shalom. Akiyamwa, Ababa, Ababa.